and one of the reasons is the mere level of prediction for an entire society that is possible. I mean, there's if anybody in any intelligence agency has any idea what they're doing, um, you could be in trouble. So, yeah. um, pretty incredible stuff, and uh, just really like mine. I'm just so adamantly against Facebook, Google Plus, Twitter. But it's because they're, they're companies. The, the oh, problem it's is... It's not so much that they're companies, it's more like the fact that they're companies means that they're at the whim of at least the United States for uh, giving up the data freely. And a lot of times, uh, the reality is that a lot of times that information is given without even asking for it. It's just, hey, we have this information. Not at least what we do, but hey, we have this information. Oh, sure, you know, to send it over. And then not in other words, send it over. Yeah. The problem is, though, when you are not a member, let's say I don't log into my Google when I search, I don't have the choice to opt out anymore because you're an anonymous user, right? So if you're an actual user logged in and you say, don't keep my history, you're saying, don't keep my history. But if you're not logged in, they're kind of like, oh, well, you're anonymous.